Hello, and welcome to Blended Sense News. I'm your host, Abigail Rose. Today's top story is how grateful we are to our investors. We have had so many wonderful people contribute to the vision of Blended Sense and what we hope to achieve as a company. It's our investors that keep the dream alive of creating a comprehensive, quick, and easy-to-use production that gets the word out about small businesses across the nation. We're going to head over to my co-founder, Albert, with this season's forecast. Albert. Wow, Abigail, it is mayhem here on the trading floor. Investors are going gaga over the media tech boom. In our first season, Blended Sense launched in Austin, Texas, playing matchmaker and connecting 69 small business owners with hundreds of creative professionals. This season, we are spreading across the nation to cities like New York, Boston, Atlanta, Fort Worth, and Dallas. Investors are pouring in. Some are even using their Bitcoin to place their bets on what people are calling the next media tech unicorn. Back to you, Abigail. Wow, Albert. Seems like there's a lot of bright days in the coming months. Now, we're about to go live on the field with my co-founder, Georgie, to read some of your amazing comments of why investors invested. It's moments like these that keep us motivated to get you that return. Throwing it to you, Georgie. Thanks, Abigail. Reporting live from Mars, I'm Georgina, here to read you a couple of comments our investors have left. I learned about Blended Sense from my son and his interaction with the company. He highly respects the company and founders. My own research of the company led me to invest. I know the founders of Blended Sense, and the impression they left on me was one of awe. Their commitment, enthusiasm, drive, and ambition sets them apart, in my opinion. There is a happiness that surrounds this company, and by golly, we need some happiness. And now for some more comments with our correspondent, Lindsay. Thanks, Georgie. I'm here in Tulum with all of the social media influencers, but don't worry. We quarantined for 14 days and got a rapid COVID test and most of us are good. I'm here to read you some of our favorite investor comments. George says that as a business owner, he felt the pain of trying to implement processes and systems to manage content production. I think we can help you out, George. Michelle mentioned, that our company has a potential to be acquired by big social media players, which can result in tremendous returns. That is our plan, Michelle. And since we are in the thick of COVID right now, Jeff really understands that small businesses definitely need the service that we are providing, post-COVID especially. Fingers crossed, Jeff. And finally, Devin mentioned that he believed Blended Sense has the potential to be the next content creator unicorn. He's so glad that he got in early. We are too, Devin. Thank you so much for being with us here today in Tulum. Throwing it back to you, Abby. Thanks, Lindsay. Love those comments and love the new do. If you haven't yet invested in Blended Sense and want to jump on the opportunity, email me at abigailrose at blendedsense.com. Thanks so much for joining us. This has been the Blended Sense team with me, your host, Abigail Rose, signing off on a new kind of production. All right, cut. That's a wrap. Way to go, everybody. So good, wow. So, I mean, I, I, I surprise myself sometimes, you no, know, you're with, with how good it goes. Yeah, I just, yeah, really I just, I can't even believe it. I mean, to, to remember all these words. <laughs> oh. I think you can do <laughs> Wow, Abigail. Yep. Abigail. Oh, yeah. Duh. <laughs> I'll see you on the sunny side. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. Tune in. Don't tune out. I'll catch you when I catch you. I'll see you later or I'll see you on another time.